In other news tonight, as kids enjoy their summer vacation, some Springfield parents are thinking ahead to next fall when several changes within the school district might affect their community. ABC News Channel 20's Kimberly Howard is live outside Wanless Elementary, which closed at the end of this school year. Kimberly, what are people in that area saying? Liz, that they're worried about their property values tanking. If you take a look down this street here, you'll see several for sale signs in front of homes, but other neighbors say they're staying. They're just not sure at what cost. Now, just to recap, the students from Wanless Elementary School will go to the new Feichens Elementary on the east side of the Springfield in the fall. The north end lost another school when Pleasant Hill Elementary School announced it was closing to also consolidate with the new Feichens. No one knows for sure whether eliminating two north end schools means eventually lowering property values in the area, but one local property owner and former teacher at Wanless says that's the perception. Without the school, um, some of the families are moving away, and um, I don't think we'll be able to attract as many families to live here without the school anymore. No word on what will happen to these old buildings. Certain officials have been kicking around a bunch of ideas, among them selling the property so it can be developed into something else. But what, we're not sure. We've also heard talk about turning this building into district offices, offices for District 186 officials, but the district has not confirmed that. Live in Springfield, Kimberly Howard, ABC News Channel 20. Thanks, Kimberly. District 186's interim superintendent, Bob Lemming, says he's hoping to know what will be done with those buildings by the fall.